I think when you come at 18, everybody stands out. I mean, Serge Savard, you know, who came to us, uh, he, he was like a mountain of a man. And when he, when he put on a fur coat here, I mean, he looked like a bear. I mean, uh, but he was such a, a calm influence on the group. Uh, I always remember that about him. He had so much confidence in his ability. I mean, he was old school. His stretch was, uh, you know, a yawn and a stretch the arms and let's go. So. Uh, he was quite a character that way. He, he brought a calming influence to a young club. Um, and then you had a guy like when Randy Carlisle came. Randy, of course, uh, Randy liked to be loud and vocal, and Randy played the game hard. And if you were one of those quiet guys, and, and, and you know some of the Euros that came over a little bit quiet, Randy would get right in their face and really, you know, try and get them fired up. So he, he was a great character that way. And uh, I remember Andrew McBain, one of our first rounders. Uh, he had his old, old junior suit, so the guys used to rib him pretty good about getting a new suit. And uh, I think he paid so much for his suit, it was the only one he bought all year. So he took a ribbon over that. But uh, we, yeah, we had characters. Paul McLean uh, in the mustache. I mean, Paul was one of those guys, he'd come in the dressing room. You didn't talk to Paul until he had his first coffee. You know, he was grumpy, grumpy in the morning. And then uh, once he had his first coffee, he couldn't meet a better guy. So the guys all. You know, you got to learn your guys pretty good that way. And I remember my first couple of years, Doug Sotart, you know, the goaltender. Soapy used to put out his equipment, you know, all in perfect order, and uh, you didn't dare mess with that. And I remember Jimmy Kite bouncing into the room. Of course, Jimmy was, you know, 19 at the time, and uh, he was uh, had that bounce to his step. You know, he's excited playing in the NHL. And I remember he ran into all of Doug's stuff on the ice. Well. The game didn't go too well for Sotart that night, but uh, um, yeah, we had, we, had, we had a good tight-knit group.